Bonjour. We're going to talk today of one uh, interesting piece, which is a, a gilt bronze statue or figure representing one of the most important Chinese god, which is the god of the warriors, god of war, called Guan Di. Guan Di is a real hero from the Chinese history, and step by step he became one of the protector of the Chinese kingdom. The particular thing concerning this statue is the very fine sizzling work that we can admire on this uh, on this subject. Uh, there are two important things in this iconography. The first being that the Guandi is always dressed with uh, an armor, which protects, of course, all the warriors. And this one, particularly as a god, is also dressed with an imperial dress. And uh, this imperial dress is showing two dragons, facing dragons. One is on the on the breast and the other one on the on the knee. This is very important because it's, it means that the god Guandi dress with the imperial war dress was also the meaning of protection of the imperial uh, kingdom. Also on his right shoulder showing a tiger head. The tiger is symbolizing the West in the, the mythology of China. And this is also a very important element. To just uh, explain also the context uh, concerning these high quality bronze pieces, probably this one was uh, offered uh, by the imperial uh, workshop to the court family or prince, maybe, or even, uh, even emperor. Uh, this means because the, the representation of this Guandi is really rare on the point of view of iconography. Just as we said before, because the god is dressed with the imperial dress, and this is very, very important. And probably this piece belongs to the high rank family or even the imperial family or prince. On that period, the bronze casting was very, very important and very of the high quality for the sizzling work and also the gilding work. And after you can find this kind of bronze statue also and during the Qing dynasty, particularly in the Kangxi and Qianlong period. But this one, it's uh, really earlier and more interesting. Pieces of this level, a few pieces have been made in the, in the workshop because uh, you have many Guandis, uh, you find many Guandis on the market, but one of these uh, high level work, I think it's uh, just a few pieces were made. Uh, many details you have. First, uh, the face, which is very peaceful expression, which means the warrior or the god of warrior is very powerful, very quiet, very protector also. That can see on the face. Then after you have the hand also, the hand is kind of uh, belonging to the Buddhist teaching, the kind of teaching uh, mudra. It's very, very important that also just is going to teach to the warriors how to go through the, through the wall. And then the top hat also, uh, making as a prince, is a god prince and also emperor at the same time. This uh, exquisite work of art from the Ming Dynasty will be offered for sale on uh, June the 27th at uh, Veritas Auction House in Lisbon.